Hi. <laughs> Hi. Okay, can you notice a different angle here? I just got a very cheap tripod a couple weeks ago. I wanted to talk a little bit more about the, the things that I've been working on on my training, specifically on my swim. I've been using actually um, a lot of several things, uh, things that I'm used to, like for instance, the paddles. But I've also been using other things that are new for me, like snorkel or even this kind of weird looking uh, buoy actually. I'm an okay swimmer, you know, I used to swim when I was a kid, so I can always find my way to move forward. I think I have a pretty decent technique, but of course I just want to keep improving, be faster, especially more efficient, right? So the things that I've been using to work on that are the following. So first, um, I'm using snorkel because this is, you know, by, by starting to breathe through the mouth, it's definitely making me to focus on working on my on my stroke. So you put on the thing, you, so you put on your goggles first, right? And then you put on this thing, and then, then you're swimming, right? Of course, with this here. And then basically what you do is just focus on your stroke, right? Now the things that I use when I use this is a band that I put in the in the area around my ankle so it will keep my legs together and of course this buoy uh, called the any buoy or any buoy here um, it's a it's made out of plastic not foam the cool thing about this buoy is that you can fill it up with water and the more you fill it up with water the, of course the less buoyant it is so it makes you work harder Another thing that I've been using, and it's so crazy looking, is this set of paddles, okay, called, uh, called Shark Bike Paddle. And they're actually made by the same uh, company that makes this anyways. And these paddles are not like this type of paddles. You basically use them to work on your technique, especially the way you make your arm enter the water. I never heard about this until recently, so, so far, I'll be honest, I'm still getting used to this. The other thing that I'm using, which I love, is this set of paddles. Um, what are they called? Stroke Master, I think. Or sto Stroke Maker. Paddles like this, you see a lot of holes that you can use to, you know, put your fingers. One of the things that I learned from my coach, and it's awesome, and she said, just need to use the one that, for your finger. If you don't focus on good technique, which is basically focusing on entering your, your hand like this, and if, let's say, you en you know, your hand enters the water like this, this is going to drag a lot of water, so it's going to feel really uncomfortable. Yeah, it's, it's interesting. You see, it's, it's new stuff. I'm getting used to it. So, pull. I just got back from my swim. That was a pretty intense workout. There was this um, set, it was 40 50s. So that's what, 10, 2,000 yards? I mean, I haven't done that in forever. Once I get better on my technique, I am going to join the Masters again. But another thing that I, I've been doing and I forgot to mention is I've been going to these um, like sessions called stroke development where basically you just go you know to the pool and you swim for an hour but it's really really focused on technique and it's been great uh the quality of the coaches is just great uh they know a lot so i feel that i'm learning a lot and uh you know making friends so 
I mean, and I think that those things really help you to get excited again about swimming or doing anything new. So, Ironman Boulder, I'm coming for you. I can tell you like to see. Come to me, swing this way. Madonna, can you flip?